Hi, I'm Timothy Tracy, the Vice Principal of Washington Park School. I helped oversee the STEAM Days at Memorial School on the week of March 14th. The purpose of our STEAM projects were to have students collaborate and work together and use science, technology, engineering, art, and mathematics in all of their projects. All students collaborated together and worked as a team. On March 16th, our third graders built structures to withstand a flood and a heavy rainstorm. All students worked together to build a structure and, we, and with the structures were put to the test to see if their post-it remained dry. Students used a variety of materials to build their structure and all the structures were put to the test together in a final culminating project where we simulated an actual rainstorm and a flood. On March 17th, our first graders built leprechaun traps. All students read a story about how to catch a leprechaun. Our first grade students built a variety of leprechaun traps. Some traps featured small little pulley systems, others featured rubber bands, and others were just very creative on how our students built them. Our STARS team at Washington Park School constructed prizes for our first graders. Prizes varied from most creative leprechaun trap to most effective leprechaun trap. Those students were selected by a committee and were chosen based on their creativity and functionality of their projects. On March 18th, our kindergartners took part in their STEAM day. The students read The Three Little Pigs, a classic tale. All projects were put to the test to withstand the big bad wolf and his fierce breaths. All students got together in the auditorium to watch the simulation of the Big Bad Wolf. A hairdryer was used to mock the Big Bad Wolf and all projects were put to the test. The students were very excited and it was excellent to see all of their smiling faces. On Friday, March 18th, our second grade took part in their STEAM day. We are gonna put these shelters to the test. We have a hairdryer which is gonna simulate a wind that's gonna be similar to what you would see in a normal storm, a hurricane, and if it goes to the test after that, we have a leaf blower, which will simulate tornado winds to your house. All projects contained a figurine inside the shelter. Go ahead, check on your guy. <laughs> Perfectly fine, it looks like we have Muffin from Bluey has survived. And the chicken has survived. And Luigi is still in good shape here. Got her out. She's definitely sustained a little damage. The objective of the project was to see if the figurine and the shelter would withstand a windstorm and a tornado simulation. Pretty good. All students were very excited and all projects seemed to be pretty successful against our windstorms.